it's time to cancel all your expensive AI monthly subscriptions because in this video I'm going to show you how you can get all of them at just a fraction of the cost. This can save you hundreds or even thousands of dollars in monthly subscriptions that you're currently paying for when you don't actually have to. We're going to do that by using a tool that is called Chat LLM, which gives you access to all of these premium models for just $10 per month. Now to access this tool, you have to go over to chatllm.abacus.ai. I will leave a link for it in the description below. So make sure you go and sign up to it and follow along with the video. Now, once you create your account, you will be brought in this interface over here, which as you can see, does really look like a lot of the other LLM models that you're used to using. Over here, we have a nice chat interface with a bunch of options at the bottom and on top of the page we have the model selector in which if I actually come over here and click guys we can see all the models that Chad LLM gives us access to for just this small subscription of $10 per month and you can see it basically has any model that you would actually need it has Cloud 4.1 Opus, it has GPT-5, it has Gemini 2.5 Pro, Grog 4 Mini and a bunch of other models as you can see they have 24 LLM models they also have access to Perplexity Pro and the good part with this is you can basically come over here and select any model that you want to use. So let's say I wanted to use Cloud 4.1 Opus for the message that I'm going to send. All I would have to do is simply come over here and select it. And then this would actually select Cloud 4.1 Opus. So then I could simply come over here and use it just as I would use any other LM. And simply come over here and type in my prompt. So let's say I want to generate email copy for my brand new video editing offer. So all we have to do is simply come over here and say, create me email copy for my brand new video editing offer so I can promote it in my email list of YouTube creators. And then all we have to do is simply come over here and send over this message. And now what LLM is going to do is going to use Cloud 4.1 Opus to generate this email. And as you can see, it did just that guys. Over here we can see the copy of the email. And what I really like with this is that it also generated us a follow-up email which we can send to follow up with our email list. And I got to admit that is pretty good. But let's say you did not like the output of Cloud 4.1 Opus. Well, all you would have to do is to simply come over here and pick any other LLM model that you would want. Maybe you would want to use GPT-5 for this example. All you have to do is to simply select it and come over here, simply copy your original prompt, paste it in over here in the chat and then click on enter again. And now you will get copy for the same offer but by GPT-5 this time. And this is a very easy way to which you can compare outputs of different LLMs to find the one that you actually want to use the majority of the time. And as you can see, this is actually pretty different because Cloud and GPT-5 obviously give you different results. And this time it gave us a bunch of options over here as you can see, like it gave us a lot of potential copies that we can use so we can basically pick the one that we want. But now what I really like with Chad LLM is let's say you're kind of new to AI and you don't really know which model is better for each task and you don't actually know which one you should pick. Well, all you have to do is to come over here and select the route LLM option. If you have this option enabled, Chad LLM looks at the task that you want to do and then it goes and picks the best model for that specific task. So now let's say we wanted to do a completely different task, we wanted to write some code and we don't know which model is best for writing code. Well, all we would have to do is we have selected the route LLM and we simply could come over here and say, write me a short snippet of code for a quick game that I can play in my browser. We simply come over here and click on enter and now route LLM, as you can see, it chose to use Cloud for Sonnet, which if you know anything about coding, this is the model that basically everyone tells you to use when you're writing code. So that means that it actually picked the most optimal model for the task that we told it to do. And as you can see, when we're writing code, this opens up this brand new interface, which has the code over here to the left, and we also have the option to preview the game and actually play it to see how it works. So if I come over here and click on start game, how does this work exactly? I have no idea, I probably should have read the instructions, but you can see that it is actually functioning. Oh, I think I just need to click it. Yeah, I just need to click the thing. And the more I click it, the more points I get, but this is a constantly moving target. So that is the game basically. It's actually pretty cool. I really like it and you also have the option to download it if you want but let's say that we don't want to do that so let me just click off of it and now let me show you another function that LLM has because what's amazing about it is it doesn't just give you access to LLMs 
It also gives you access to a bunch of different image generators. So let me come over here and open a brand new chart so we don't have anything written over there. And let's say this time we want to generate an image with a model like Mid Journey, for example, which is a model that in the cheapest plan costs $10, while Chart LLM has the same price but gives you access to so many more models. So let's say we wanted to use Mid Journey, generate an image, then this tab will open up. And over here you can see we can select from a bunch of different image generation models and all of these models have paid plans guys that go all the way from ten dollars to up to fifty dollars plus per month and you can access all of them to here with just a ten dollar subscription so let's say we want to use mid journey for this example then over here in the version i will select version 7 which is the latest version and over here i simply need to type in my prompt to generate the image so let's say i want to generate a big forest with a lot of trees all I would have to do is to simply come over here and type in a big forest with a lot of trees. And then I simply come over here and I click on generate. And as you can see, ChatLM is using me journey to generate us our image right now. So all we have to do is wait till it is done. And boom, it just finished generating. And look at these images, guys. Like these images really do look amazing. They look super realistic. Like I personally couldn't tell that this was made by AI. And it gave us four of these amazing images over here, which we can actually go over here and download if we actually want. But now let's say you did not like the mid-journey images and you simply want to generate the same images just with another LLM model. Again, all you have to do is come over here. Then you select the LLM model you want to generate the images with. Let's say you want to use Flux Pro Ultra, which is another paid image generation model. Model. Then over here you can also select the number of images you want to generate. I will leave it in one for this one. And let's say this time I actually wanted to generate, I don't know, uh, one flower hanging off the edge of the cliff. All you have to do is simply type in your prompt and then come over here and click on generate. And now ChatLM is going to use Flux Pro Ultra to generate this image for you. And boom, look at that guys. This was actually a super hard prompt to get right because a flower at the edge of the clip is like kind of hard to imagine how you would be able to draw that. But I do think it did a very good job. And as you can see, this actually looks super realistic guys. So I definitely got to say both Mid Journey and Flux Pro did a very good job with this prompt. But we're not done yet guys because we don't only have access to LLMs and text to image generators we also have access to basically all the most popular text to video generators as well which you can actually access from coming all the way down here to where you see the view more tools option simply click on it and then come all the way up here to video gen and once you select this you will be brought over here in this small interface where you can select the model that you want to use which as you can see they have Kling AI they have Runway which actually costs $70 and is a pretty expensive model they also have VO3 VO2 and a bunch of other models for this video let's say i wanted to use runway which is an actually pretty expensive model then over here i also have the option to upload an image to basically make this an image to video generator but i'll simply choose to pass on that and i'll simply write simple prompt so let's say i wanted to generate a video of a man dancing in the rain all that we have to do is to simply come over here and say generate a video of a man dancing in the rain and then I can come over here and select the aspect ratio. I will leave it as it is. Then I can also select the duration in seconds. I can select either 5 or 10. I will leave this on 5. And then I simply come over here and click on generate. Which cannot actually run because it does require an image. So let me actually find an image of a man and then upload it over here. So I found this image of a man in the rain. I will simply come over here and download it. Then come over here and simply upload it. And then I can finally come over here and click on generate. And boom, as you can see, ChatLM is using Runway right now to generate us this video. So all we have to do now is to simply wait till it is done. And boom, it just finished generating the video. So if we actually open it up in full screen and take a look at it, we can see that he's copying and dancing in the rain, which is actually pretty funny. But you can see that we did manage to successfully generate the video with Runway, which actually has a pretty costly monthly subscription. But now I want to show you another feature of ChatLM which is the projects feature and to access that feature all you have to do is to come over here to the left where you see projects and simply click on the plus icon to open up a brand new project and then you can simply give a name to your project so let's say I want to create a project about generating YouTube titles for my intros what I can do is simply come over here and type in YouTube titles and then I could also provide a description if I want it I do not need a description so I will not provide any over here you also have the option to share it with your team or keep it only to yourself. I will keep this only to myself for now. And then you simply click on create. And what this does guys is it creates a brand new project over here. Which is similar to how ChatGPT projects and Cloud projects work. 
You can see over here you have access to the custom instructions which how these projects work guys. It's basically a standard chat with your LLM but this time you can basically give it some instructions of how you want the LLM to act so you don't constantly have to come and manually type in the instructions you want every single time. And how you're able to do that is by either coming over here in the custom instructions and clicking on add instructions where over here you can simply type in the instructions that you want. So let's say for example for my YouTube titles I want them to be short and use as many shocking words as they possibly can to draw the viewer's attention. So all I have to do is to simply come over here and type in Hey make sure my titles are short and they use as many shocking words as possible to grab the viewer's attention. Obviously you come over here and add in a bunch of more rules that you want for your project to have. For example I could also say they shouldn't exceed 52 words and they should convey the topic of the video very clearly. And once you're done giving your instructions all you have to do is to come over here and click on update. And what this will do is it will basically save these instructions. So every time you come over here and want to generate brand new YouTube titles, for example, the chat looks inside your custom instructions and inside your project files if you have any. So you, maybe you had some PDFs with examples of YouTube titles that you like. All you have to do is to simply come over here, click on upload files and simply upload these files from your computer. And then this project will also has access to that. So it would go take all of this into account and then give you a response. It actually saves you a lot of time, believe it or not, guys. Because if you did not do it that way, you would basically have to come over here and write in the same instructions every single time to your prompt, which does get annoying very fast. And just to show you how this actually works, and let's say I want to generate titles for the best LLM model in 2025. I'll simply come over here and describe my video. Generate titles for a video that I try to find the best LLM in 2025. And then I'll simply come over here and click on enter. And now what this will do guys is it will look inside my project files and it will take them into account and give me these titles which as you can see do follow my instructions very well. They do use shocking words as much as they can. They also are not super long which if you go to any LM and you tell it to give you YouTube titles you will see that they usually tend to be super long and they also convey the message of the video very clearly. And as you can see with this generation we used route LM which decided that the best model for this specific task was Gemini 2.5 flash. Now if you do not like this response all you have to do is to simply come over here to where you see regenerate using and then over here you can select any model you want to regenerate this response. So let's say I want to use Cloud I simply come over here click on Cloud and this will regenerate the response with Cloud 4. And boom these are the titles that ChatLM generated us with Cloud 4. Now I do gotta admit I kind of like these titles more than the previous ones but again this is more up to your preference and you can always come over here and select the model that you want. But now I want to show you some very interesting features that ChatLM also offers that I think would be very useful to basically anyone. So let me come over here and create a brand new chat and the first feature that I want to show you is the web search feature which when we enable we're basically able to tell a LLM to search the web and then give us a response based on the information that it finds in the internet. So let's say I wanted the latest AI news of this summer. All we have to do is to simply type it over here, make sure I enable the web search and then come over here and click on enter. And now what this will do is it will pick a model that is able to search the web guys as you can see it picked GPT-5 mini and it's actually going to go do the web search and then based on the information that it found the web give us a response for the latest AI news of this summer. And boom guys, as you can see the latest AI news, summer 2025 and over here we can see the news with sources next to them so we can actually click on them and actually go and read them for ourselves if we actually want to. And that brings us over to the next very interesting feature that I think would actually help a lot of you especially the ones that are still in school right now or in college which is the humanized text feature because guys if I actually take this text for example I simply copy all of it and I go over to any AI detector and I simply paste it in over here and click on detect text you can see that it basically tells us that this is more than likely AI generated text well ChatLM actually offers a feature which is called the humanized text feature which you can access by coming over here to more and then coming all the way over here and clicking on humanize. Here you simply need to select your tone, let's say we want to make it AI detector proof and then you simply make sure you have this on turn on so it applies to all the new messages we're going to send it and then we said give me the latest 
AI news and we also enable the websites and we click on send this is going to go do basically the exact same thing but this time it's going to return as text that is undetectable from AI detectors so as you can see it gave us this response which if we actually come over here if we copy it we come back over to the AI detector paste it in and click on detect text you can see that this text is likely human written so it basically is able to pass every AI detector which is a super useful feature especially for people that are still in school and have to do essays and they don't want the teachers to know oh John for example wrote this with AI so if you don't want to get a code you can actually use this feature but remember you did not hear this from me now another super useful feature that they offer is text to speech which you can access by coming over here to more and then coming over here and selecting text to speech over here you can select the platform that you want to use for the text to speech I will select 11 labs which is actually a paid program and you will actually need a subscription for that as well then you, over here you need to select the model I will leave it on flash and then over here you can also select the voice that you want to use let's say I want to use Sarah for example and I want to say please like this video if you find it useful and subscribe to the channel and then if I come over here and click on generate you can see that it just generated the voiceover and if I click on it please like this video if you find it useful and subscribe to the channel as you can see it tells you to like the video and sub to the channel so make sure you also do that and now it's time I actually show you the next and most interesting feature for me that I have seen inside ChatLM which is none other than the N810 assistant and since my channel is mainly creating N810 automations I have actually found this feature super useful now to access this feature all you have to do is to come over here and click on the button to select the model that you want to use and you need to come over here and navigate to custom chatbots where you can see a bunch of custom chatbots that ChatLM offers for a bunch of different tasks like prompt craft mentor, onboarding autopilot app and a bunch of other more but the one that I really found very interesting is the N810 expert assistant which what that is is basically a chatbot that is trained in N10 data and is actually able to answer any question that you might have for any N10 issue you're going to face and also write you JSON code which you can copy and paste and basically build an automation without you having to hop inside N10 and build it yourself and just to show you that this actually works let me come over here and test it let's say I want to build an AI agent that retrieves information from my customers that I have inside a Google Sheet based on that information and the message that I give it it either goes and emails the customer with my video editing offer or it goes and sends an SMS to the customer with my video editing offer so let me come over here and simply describe this to the N810 expert assistant so I will simply come over here and say so now I'll simply come over here and click on enter and now the N810 the expert assistant is going to write me the full JSON as you can see over here for this exact automation and boom it just finished writing the full JSON so all I have to do is to simply come over here and copy it and if I go over to N10 and create a brand new workflow and click on control V which is actually going to paste all the JSON code and as you can see this AI agent populates for us automatically which actually has all the correct tools over here we have a chat message in which we will basically tell it hey I want you to send an email or an SMS to this person then over here we have the Google Sheet which if I actually open up sure I do need to simply fill this in with AI or simply select the Google Sheet that I want to retrieve information from then we also have access to the Gmail tool which if I actually open up over here we can see that it is automatically filled it in with AI which is very nice and we also have access to the Twilio tool which again it automatically filled in with AI so we basically have this AI agent 90% ready simply because we use the N810 assistant from ChatLM. So these are just some of the most interesting features that I have found in ChatLM. It obviously has a bunch of more features over here, especially if you come over here and click on more, you will be able to see all of these features, which you can actually go and discover for yourself by clicking the link in the description and signing up to ChatLM. So I do want to say a big thank you to ChatLM because they did agree to sponsor this video, but they also gave me complete freedom to tell you my honest opinion. And I personally think this is a complete steal because you get access to all of these different models for just $10 per month so in my opinion you should definitely go and sign up to it I will also be using it a lot from now on simply because it will save me a lot of money on all the subscriptions that I'm currently paying so again go to chatlm.abacusai.ai or click the link in the description and it will automatically take you there and sign up to ChatLM to try it out. But now YouTube thinks you're going to enjoy this video in which I use this tool over here from Abacus AI which is called Deep Agent to complete high paying Upwork listings. So make sure you go and watch the next and I will see you over there.